popping, man. This is called whiskey, man. You already know how I do it, man. A lot of people dropping videos. Ain't nobody dropping a video like this. <laughs> ain't woke in whiskey. Man, y'all can't stop me, man. Make sure y'all sub, man. But hey, man, Young Pharaoh and Shah Jamal. But look, before Rashad Jamal got locked up, I keep I kept hearing Young Pharaoh say something like, I hope he better not get locked up. And he said Rashad Jamal is going to kiss the FBI and all that and blase blase. And uh, yeah, this is going to be a very important video. This happened before he got locked up. This is crazy. <laughs> did he speak into existence or did he have something to do with it? Y'all tell me. Let's get it. Do you see how I'm living and you see how he living? White niggas always speaking. I don't understand what. <laughs> this dude is too funny though. Damn. Niggas keep speaking on my name. You never in your life. You never in your life nothing. On my level. You never in your life nothing on my level. Brianna Barella, you want to go live real quick? You never in your life nothing. <laughs> you never in your life nothing on my level. That's why I don't under. Like I said, I don't understand it. But like I said, I can't. I can't. I can't watch niggas I don't like. I never watch niggas I don't like. Golden to tell you that. I don't watch niggas I don't like. I don't watch shit I don't like. Period. You know what I mean, somebody else sent me the clip. Y'all sent it to me before. Send me the clip again so I can send it to Golden. You feel me? Somebody send me the clip so I can send it to Golden. That motherfucker's out of here. He's a black extremist. Either the, either the, either the, the he's a black extremist. He's out of here. He's out of here. You heard that? He said he's a black extremist. He's out of here. He's out of there. He's spitting everywhere. <laughs> Rashad Jamal, man, I think you done messed up, dude. I hope this dude had nothing to do with you getting locked up. Because that shows a lot, man. That's crazy. And I talked to Skinner this morning. I talked to They, they want to be me so bad. It don't make no I'm about to pull a bruh up. I'm about to. Y'all heard that? Did y'all hear that? He said he talked to Skinner this morning. Who is Skinner? Does Skinner have something to do? With the whole Rashad Jamal thing? Because <laughs> we all know it's a white person. He always hang with the white people. But hey, keep listening, man. I'm walking the whiskey, dude. This is crazy. Pull a bra up. Let me pull a bra up. Let me pull a bra up. What? Let me pull a bra up. Niggas want to be me so bad. They didn't fucked around. And now they about to get they... Now they about to get what they signed for. Because the niggas are black extremists. He really is a black extremist. And like I said, when the FBI come to his house... Because he's a black extremist and he threatened to kill Golden, me, and the kids. I'm not going to... The nigga threatened to kill me, Golden, and the kids. I'm you heard that right. So I guess what Shah Jamal did that back then. You know what I'm saying? But after that, Young Pharaoh kept speaking into existence about something happening to Shah Jamal because of, Young Pharaoh said that he'd be hanging with the white man. You feel me? <laughs> this dude is crazy, man. I don't know him. You know what I'm saying? I don't even need it. They can, you know what I'm saying? I, tr I don't even need to. Like I said, they go get him because he's a black extreme. I, I don't know him. I don't even know him. I don't <laughs> even know the nigga. <laughs> he said he's a black extreme. This and in the, in the, in the NIGGA going to get locked up. Hey, man, young Pharaoh, man. If you have something to do with him getting locked up, that's crazy. So that means. Everything you're saying is true. You're really working with the white man. You're really working with the higher ups. You know what I'm saying? And you know, I thought you was going against them, but I guess you, you're working with them now. I don't know. I don't care at the end of the day, but Rashad Jamal's locked up. And let's listen to a little bit more. Listen. I don't even know the nigga. I'm out here with the white man on the motherfucking. You know what I'm saying? It's roses and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to have my babies out here playing with the beautiful flowers and the motherfucking. You know what I'm saying? Golf. White niggas always speaking on my name. White <laughs> niggas always speaking on my name. Ah, uh, man, he's out there with the white man chilling with his flowers and all that, and white people speaking on his name. <laughs> See, y'all got to pay attention, man. He's putting it right in y'all face, just like a lot of these YouTubers do, and y'all still try to go against these dudes. 
we can't win. You know what I'm saying? All these fake woke false prophets dudes believe in their third eye. They working with somebody, man. Be careful. Stay away from them, man. Hey, <laughs> listen to a little bit more, though. It's too funny. Oh, no, the nigga, the nigga. Listen here. That's all I know. All I know is the nigga start trying to be me. He started trying to beat me. He started stealing my teachings, acting like they was his, and then trying to down talk my university. When my shit official, I got permission from the from the governor of Texas to run my university. I can go in there and show you the paperwork. You can't even, because I want y'all to know something. Technically, you can't call your school a university unless you got permission from the from the local governor of the state. So I, I noticed that Rashad Jamal thing is called the University of blah, 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 right? And Young Pharaoh's saying right here that it's illegal to do that. But it was cool until Young Pharaoh said it's illegal to do it. So what's going on here? Is y'all listening? <laughs> so he already in trouble with the state right there because he don't even got no permission to be running the university. I'm the only black person in the country that got permission to be running the university. So that's where he <laughs> fucked up right there. And then for two, where he fucked up is you still in my shit, then trying to talk shit to me. When you still in my shit, when you still in my shit, but you trying to talk to me, you know what I'm saying? But you trying to. <laughs> hey, man, I don't know who's stealing from who, man. All y'all say the same stuff, man. It just y'all just do it differently and got your own ways of saying it, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. How you going to steal my shit then try to talk down to me because I didn't want to interact with you because I didn't want to be your friend? I ain't want to be his friend, and he got mad. That's what happened. I ain't want to be his friend, and he got mad. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, check me out, man. It's Woke and Whiskey. I need y'all to comment, comment, comment how y'all feel about this, man. Do y'all think that young Pharaoh has something to do with him getting locked up because of what he's saying? Somebody please tell me. Or y'all think it's just happening coincidentally? I don't know what's going on. <laughs> it's Woke and Whiskey, and I'm gone.